boxes from USPS. These are free, by the way. So I got a whole bunch of boxes from them. I can't remember the dimensions. Let me see. I think they're right here. There's too much. What is it? Um, 11 by eight and a half by five. Okay, so that's what those are. I ordered two different sets of them. I bought two sets and each set had 25 boxes in them. I didn't even tell you guys what I sell or my brand name. Let's rewind. So, my name is Ashley. I'm the proud owner of AMM Beauty. AMM Beauty stands for my initials. So first name's Ashley, middle name's Marie, and then I'm not going to tell you guys my last name because I don't need y'all finding me. So, yeah. And then beauty, I originally was supposed to be AMM Nails. Well, I can't speak. It was supposed to be AMM Nails, but I thought I really wanted to get into like everything beauty-wise. So like hair, nails, makeup, accessories, sunglasses, jewelry, body care, skin care, all that. So I thought beauty would be a better term to use because it's such a broad spectrum. So basically what I sell and what I offer are press-on nails, lip gloss, lip scrubs, body butter. Ooh, more than that. I'm going to get into like hair care, which is something I really want to do. Oh, accessories. So like sunglasses and jewelry. These are one of the necklaces I'll be offering. This is my Virgo chain because I'm a Virgo. Also, I do um, glow drops, which is like body highlight. I have two different versions right now. There's one called Brown Skin Girl, which is like the golden shimmery one. And then I have one that's called Rosé, which is like a rosy tone shimmery highlight. So I have those two. So I'm working on lashes as well. I'm trying to find a solid vendor right now and i'm testing out some lashes so yeah i'm having i'm testing them out i'm having my sister test them out as well and we're gonna see how that goes if you're interested in purchasing anything that i have to offer head over to ammbeauty.com everything is reasonably priced you don't have to worry about paying 50 dollars for this 40 dollars for that like, I wanted to make sure it was reasonably priced for people similar to me because I like a bargain. So what I was going to show you before I went on a whole rant was my nails, the nails that I use. So these are my stiletto nails. Let me show you. Um, these are my stiletto nails that I use. Can you see? Can you see? It? Can you see? It? So yeah, these are them. These are how they look. Yeah. All right, so that's one set. This was, ooh, it was definitely in the teens. I think it was like $13 or something like that. But yeah, you get a decent amount. You get like 500 in these. So I bought this one, the stiletto. And then I bought the square. Let me show you the square. So this is how they look. Ta -da. Let me take it out. Can you work? Come on. Today. Now. So these are the square tips. So yeah, same price. I got these from Amazon. I'll link it down below. These are the nail glues that I use for my on nails the artisan the artisan nail glue these work really good like the minute you put this on your nails you better hurry up and slide that and press on like this this is the two ounce bottle that i have for my glow drops so these are the bigger versions right now what i'm offering are the minis so there's a complete difference it's doubled in size this version. So these are the minis that I offer right now. These are going to be coming to the site soon. Not sure when. I feel like I'm just dropping so many things at once. It's like I need to slow it down. You know, have something for next week. Not run through all your stuff. So 
yeah i'm not sure when i'll be watching these but they'll be coming these are also from amazon not sure how much these are but i'll put it in the description like i keep saying for everything these are my rose gold wand tubes i don't know why i bought these honestly because they don't go with the color scheme they're rose gold they're pretty they're really pretty but they don't go with the scheme so these are just gonna be my limited edition and once they sell out they sell out and that's it this is ice me out it's like a sparkly silver color and i have my new lip gloss which is pink lemonade they all smell really good this smell smells like pink lemonade this one smells like vanilla which is ice me out this is melon blast it smells like watermelon it's like a nice pinky red color I tried to make it more red, but that didn't happen. But I still thought it was pretty. So yeah, these are available now. If you're interested, head on over to my website. I bought this from Michaels. These hold all my gems that I use for my nails. So let me try to show you guys what they look like. I don't want to tilt it too much, but this is what they look like. Pretty. I use the this one specifically for the bigger stones and then I use this one for the smaller stones. So I'll show you guys these. Much smaller. Alright, so I have more organza bags. These are the bigger ones that hold a lot. Let me show you. These can hold all three of those glosses I just showed you, as well as another like four. And then add a lip scrub in there. And yeah, you can hold those. So these are the four by six organza bags. I got these from Amazon as well. Yeah. Oh, how many was in that pack? I think it was a hundred in that pack for eight bucks. So yeah, these. And then I got this. These are the, you know how like when you soak off your nails, you use like the foil and the cotton method. So these, I bought uh, two boxes of them. And it's basically the cotton and the foil. And I'll just put these in my nail kits for customers so that they have pretty much everything in that little goodie bag to um, apply the nails and remove other than acetone so yeah i bought two boxes of these let me see they're from the brand artisan i got these from the nail superstore as well as the glue that i showed you before and I'm not sure how many is in here oh there's a hundred of these in here as well let me turn it around yeah i see my address you thought you thought you were gonna catch me i ain't lacking over here okay <laughs> So, I bought some mini buffers. What is this? Oh, the return label. Disregard. So, I bought some mini buffers. So, you what they look like. I believe I got these from Amazon. Got them from Amazon. These will be in the little kits as well. It's pink and white. I wish they had turquoise and white, but you know. Pink is on everything at this point now so yeah i'll probably put like two in each little goodie bag but yeah i got them from amazon i'm not sure how much they were but <laughs> all right mom disregard my mom's hiding the lot please i have squeeze tubes for my lip glosses as well as wand tubes like I said, those wand tubes are gonna be limited stock. So once they're sold out, they're sold out. But I did just buy, well not just buy, I bought them like last week. I just bought more wand tubes that are gonna be my signature wand tubes. So I'll show you guys that when they get here. But I got these, these are my standard um, squeeze tubes. I didn't do anything smaller than this. This is a 15 ml squeeze tubes. Cause I'm like, I want my lip gloss a lot long and i want a lot of it so i thought this is perfect because anything smaller than this is like what's the point <laughs> it's 
like, you're gonna send me this, this little lip gloss? Like, no, you can keep it. I don't want it. Unless it's a sample. Actually, I take that whole statement back. If it's a sample, then okay. But if it's just like, that's your size for your gloss, no, I don't want it. You're fired. Leave the premises or you will be escorted off. Have it your way. Show you guys my lash boxes. This is just a tester. This is not what it's going to look like completely, but this is the box basically, if that makes sense. I hope that makes sense. So this is what the box looks like. Can you see it? It's hollow. Okay, so, oh, and the sides are hollow as well. So yeah, I'll be having my lashes in these. You open it up. This is just a sample lash that I bought. But you open it up, this is what it looks like. Pretty. So yeah, and then the box looks like this. So I'll probably do another video of how it really looks when I get it, which will be like a month from now. Let me stop. It'll probably be like two weeks from now. So yeah, waiting for those to come. But I recently um, came across this new brand and I started using their flavorings of my lip gloss. And when I tell y'all, it smells bomb. Like, my whole room smell like a candy store. That's how good it smells. So, this is the brand I've been using. It's called Get Suckered. This flavor is Peach Martini. Haven't used it yet, but I definitely will. Um, this is strawberry. This is what size is this? This is the one ounce jar versus the how many ounces? The point thirty three ounce. So big difference. This one was $7.99 and this one was $3.70 something. So I got a whole bunch of them. Hold on, let me show you. So I got a whole bunch of them. All a bunch. And all of these were like $30 something dollars and that was cheap. So yeah, I got a whole bunch of flavors. Let me see. This one I used, the pink lemonade. And I barely made a dent on it. We have cake batter, which is chocolate, which I don't know. It it smells okay, but it smells like okay. So let's put it this way. You know how a brownie smells, and you know how what a Tootsie Roll smells like. Two completely different things, but they're chocolate. This one smells like a Tootsie Roll. I'm not a big fan of Tootsie Rolls, not the chocolate ones, like the fruity ones. Alright. The chocolate one. But I mean, it's okay. But all the other ones that I bought are really good. Really, really good. I got the watermelon one. This one. This one. The best one. I'm gonna buy the bigger bottle. I'm gonna buy the gallon if they got it. This one smells so good. So good. Just, oh, let me open it. Let me, let me open it. Let me open it. I can't open it. <laughs> It has like that child proof. <laughs> you gotta push down, open it like it's medicine. Hold on. Bro. Thank you. This is uh, heaven versus gel. So I got this from the Voyager Soap and Candle, the company in Canada. So. I got this like a month ago. I got five pounds, so five of these. And when I opened the box, like half of the stuff was poured out into the box. I would show y'all, but it's all the way over there and it's just, mm. but let me see, like, can you see it? There's like verses y'all all over this. So it's like, I spent $100 or something like that something close to that on all of this for it to come and some of it's leaking the packaging like to secure this wasn't even elite like they had some stack like this and then they have some stack like this so obviously it's gonna pour out of here but whatever 
I don't know. I mean, it's good versus Joe. Versus Joe is versus Joe, but it's like, come on. You're packaging a whole bunch of liquid, basically. You should be able to, you should have it, like, wrapped up nicely so that, especially if it's coming from Canada. So it's like, come on. Come on. <laughs> People paying all this money and for it to come half empty. Like, what? I want my money. Where it? But, yeah, I didn't really blow it out of proportion. I'm just like, you know what, whatever, it's here. I can start making lip gloss. So, yeah. I don't know. Even now, my hands are sticky because it's... Alright. <laughs> Moving on. Avery! So, I got a whole bunch of labels. I got... Let me show you. I got these labels for my face only. Yes, that's me. And so I got a whole bunch of these. These are the two inch circle labels. So I got about three pages of those. And then I have the three inch circle labels. Where they at though? What? Where they at though? What they at though? All right. So these are the three inch labels that I got. Yeah, they're cool. And I got about three pages of those. And then I got these. So these are mainly for my lip glosses. But I'm kind of struggling with them right now using these because they don't really stick all the way. But for the most part, they're doing okay. It's just I have to put a little bit more pressure on the lip glosses when I put them on. Which isn't all that bad, but yeah. So I got these. These came in a pack of... Well, it was like four pages, but it had 96 or 92 labels all together for these alone. And then for the circles, it was like 24. And then the other ones was like around that range. All of this was about 60 something dollars, 62, 63. And then I bought a Cricut printer or Cricut machine, sorry. So I'll be using that to make labels for my lip glosses and other products and stuff like that. So I'm excited about that. Now that machine better be God because I spent 200 and something dollars on that machine. So it better be printing out labels left and right. It better be printing out labels when I'm sleeping. It better be printing out labels on its own. It don't even have to, I don't even have to do it. Just do it on your own. So this one is the watermelon one that I showed you in that um, one too. So here she is. Got my little label on it, but you can see it's like lifting. So that's the main issue I've been having with these. All right, so the next one is just your basic clear. This is coconut scented, coconut, coconut flavored. This is called Princess, it's shimmery, pink shimmer. This one is strawberry. So this is Cosmo Wanda obviously come on look at the green and pink this one is strawberry kiwi scented this is golden goddess it's pretty it's pineapple scented blue popsicle so this will be a blue raspberry scent but it's pretty right goes with the color schemes petals so this is my edible rose petal lip gloss how pretty she is i forgot to tell you guys that i'm having a big sale next week due to me graduating next friday and i'll be celebrating somewhat on saturday so i'm going to be having 20 percent off of my entire site 20 percent class of 2020 you get it so yeah that will be happening next friday which will be the 29th may 29th and may 30th 